Hi my lovelies, so today I have a autumn get kind of like chatty makeup tutorial. I went like full on, full on smoky, grungy, I feel very autumn-y, like very wintry. I really really do hope you guys will enjoy this video and we'll jump straight into it. Okay, so my skin feels super super dry right now so I'm going to use the Glam Glow Moisturiser. This is what it looks like, I had already purchased the Nude Glow but this one is Sun glow it's a bit of a darker one so they have three shades it's pearl glow new glow and sun glow i didn't get sun glow because i thought it was going to be too dark for me but it's actually really nice it's more of a bronzy color so if you're pale it will do, definitely give you a bit of a slight like bronziness to your skin um i've been loving these moisturizers like they're so good and they smell like cocoa butter i feel like this is what sun glow looks like and i literally just take a dollop and i'm just gonna On my skin you can't really see it, which just gives this nice luminosity to your skin. You can get power glow and just put it on the highest points of your cheeks as like a highlighter, it's actually really nice. So next I'm going to go in with my Makeup Forever Step 1 Equalizer, this is the smoothing one. I'm just going to put this just like here where I get like a bit more like pores. Kind of like smooths it out, it does mattify and I do put it on my smile lines. So now I'm going to go in with my MAC Conceal and Correct Duo in the orange shade. Do two dots. Blend that out. And I'm going to go with my Sleek Foundation. My Sleek Lash Proof Foundation in the shade LP11. I do have a full review on this so I'll link it in the info box if you guys want to check it out. Believe it or not guys, today I... It's now... I don't even know what time it is. It's kind of like 3.30, I woke up at 3 o'clock. Can you believe that? I woke up at 3. My head has been giving me a really hard time. And then I was like, oh my god, I need to film. So I thought, let me just do a chatty autumn makeup kind of look because I feel winter's coming. Oh, Game of Thrones. It's true, like it's raining, it's cold. I feel like I'm getting, I'm getting a cold coming up. Um, this foundation does go, is more matte, definitely, because obviously when I did the review I had put like a really hydrating moisturiser. So it definitely comes out more matte. Over the weekend, so normally I work, obviously I work weekends. I was supposed to, I need to cut my brows out. <laughs> um, I was supposed to like film my, I have two foundations that I need to review, which is the Max Factor Healthy Skin Foundation and the Charlotte Tilbury Magic, what's it called? Magic Foundation. So I was supposed to like film it over Saturday and Sunday so I can have that ready on the week. Nope, I couldn't wake up, I just couldn't. Like. We are going to go on to concealer. I stocked up on my um, Tarte Shape Tape. I actually bought it from one of my subscribers. I'm just going to finish up my old one first before opening the new one. And I saw that this is in a shade Tan Sand. And I saw that it's out of stock online. Obviously it is definitely a very popular concealer. I just feel like I want to do my base and then my eyes. Even though I'm going to do like a full on smoky eye. I'm just going to put a bit on the top as well. As I just carve my eyebrows with that. I'm going to use my Ben Night Banana Powder to set that. Just put it on the top there again. I wanted to quickly mention like all of you that are living in like Miami and the Caribbean in the Caribbeans in the Caribbeans um, and in Florida like I hope you're all safe with like the hurricane I mean it's like really I can't imagine I can't imagine what you guys are going through and like I don't know what's now happened I'm guessing it's I think it's just hit, like it's hit you guys over the night and it's still hitting you guys but I hope that you guys are safe and sound and yeah i just wanted to put that out here like my heart goes out to you all who are going through the hurricane um harvey there's like been a 
earthquake in Mexico and then there's been like a flood in I think it was in India this is just like oh my god mother nature is pissed off I'm gonna use my NYX lingerie lid lingerie palette this is what the palette looks like and I'm gonna go in with this shade first look at my hair it's like glossy Ooh. obviously the lighting's doing that but make sure to watch my hair care routine and put it up last week I feel like I sound really quiet today. I'm so like weird like that. Some days I'm super hyper and some days I'm just like really like zen. Most of the time I'm quite zen. I'm not like a really loud person in general anyways. Apart from when I'm at home maybe. And I really need to get comfortable with you if I, if I get loud like that. as well and they're gonna take this color right here and just put it slightly under kind of building it up on it Just grab a clean brush and just blend and diffuse the edges. It really does work. Now on on for on top of the lid right there, I'm actually going to go in with my Soul Culture palette, and I'm going to use the shade All Star, which is this shade right here. I feel like it's a stunning color for the smoky eye. I mean, you can use anything you want that is similar to this color. I'm just going to pack this on. some on a lower lash line I'm going to use some of my LA Girl Endless Liner in very black and I'm just going to really like darken out my lash line I'm just going to do top You see difference? I do feel like I've managed to get some eyeshadow on my yeah. Just curl your lashes. I don't think I'm gonna put falsies today. You know when you're just not in the mood? So you can totally put some if you want to for this look. I'm just going to take the first colour that we use from the NYX palette and I'm just going to kind of clean up the edges. And then for mascara I'm going to use the Maybelline Big Shot Mascara. I'm really concentrating at the roots. Digging this look. I knew I was going to wear a, like a smoky eye, so that's why I wore my contacts because I feel like when I wear smoky eye contacts it looks so good with it. Okay, so now I'm just going to go on to bronzing my face. I'm going to use my MAC Mineralized Skin Finish in Dark Deep. I've been loving this blush lately, so I'm going to use this. It's the LA Girl Just Blushing in Just Peachy. Right, y'all. Now, 
What is this baby hair? For highlight. Did I even bring a highlighter? Oh yeah, I did. I bought my Huda Beauty palette. I haven't used this in ages, so I thought, let me just use it. It's a bit messy. And I'm going to use Tahiti, this shade right here. I've been loving to just like highlight my cupid though. I'm also get, grabbing a bit of Seychelles of lighter powder highlight and just packing that on top just to like give a more intense glow. Okay, so now on to lips. I've got two colours. This is much warmer and this is... I feel like this would go because this is just too warm. So I'm going to go with my next lingerie liquid lipstick in Teddy. I'm going to go in with the Glam Glow setting spray. This is the Glow Setter makeup setting spray i've been using this for the past couple of days and i love it it smells like cocoa butter and the mist look at the mist it's just like a mist like a true cloudy mist and you barely feel it on your skin i'm just gonna say it Okay, so that's the finished look guys i really hope you enjoy this quick video um it's definitely like a full-on like i'm ready for autumn look you know oh my god that's what i'm gonna call it i'm ready for autumn give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe if you're new to my channel and i will see you guys in my next video bye